<sighs> Hi guys, like Sal here. Let's play Resident Evil Director's Cut. This is part 7. Uh, I sort of couldn't board this game for like a day or two, so I just decided to screw it. I'm going to continue it now. Now, uh, there's no music in the room because the room's creepy. Now, this is the part I believe we're just taking out a few hunters. So we'll go through the mess of the mansion and blow their fucking brains out. Yeah, let's go. I wonder if I can do that trick still with the. At the top of the stairs with a bazooka. I tried to show by the zombies and it fucked up, so maybe it'll give me a chance this time. Right, let's see. Look at the nice hunter. Probably won't even need to. Oh, yes. Done. Yeah, I didn't even need to that time, so I'm quite uh, chuffed with that. see, map. Where are we going? Now I believe we need to go fight a snake again. The fucking snake annoys me. I hate the snake to bits. I want the snake to die. And there's only one way I'm going to do it. Right, let's see. Go around here, go through there, go through the other door. Makes sense to me. I'm thinking that's the right way. Fuck it, let's find out. So I think that's the right way to get to the snake, but I'm not sure, so... Yeah, also if it is, I'll need to run back and get some goddamn health and stuff because there's no way I'm fighting it without any. Is this it? Please tell me it is. I've used the helmet key. Okay. Yes, it says we fight the snake. I'll need to go back and get some health. What a waste of my time. It doesn't matter though because it means I can switch to the shotgun, which is what I'm planning to use anyway for this part, I believe. It's a bit of a pain in the ass, so yeah, I'll just run back here and get that. Yeah, I'm going to switch to the shotgun, I believe it's better. I don't know why, but like sometimes I fight the snake, it, it's better fighting it with the shotgun than it is using the bazooka for some reason. Oh, sorry, did I say bazooka? I meant to say bazooka. Mr. President, there's a new dictator in town. He has the bazooka. That sounds like an elite force. My soldiers are an elite force of bazooka. You know, Raz al Ghul, Bazooka. Okay, let's see. Eh, shotgun and we'll take the shells as well and let's find some mixed herbies. Mixed herbies! Mixed herbies! Yeah, I'll take some mixed herbs, thanks. If I better take a blue herb in case it poisons me. You know, fucking things like. Eh, blue herb, please? Is, it, is there a blue herb I can take? Anybody got a blue herb? Hey, th thanks, guys! Grab the old shot of gunner. Shot of gunner, everybody. I got the shot of gunner. I want a shot of the gunner. Yeah, please, the shot of the gunner. Let's go. I'm noticing there's not as much lag this time for once. Thank fuck. I've also got Resident Evil Survivor. I was playing that. That's quite a fun game. A lot of people don't like it. Um, I quite like it. But again, it loses its like Resident Evil feel. It's uh, cause it's like completely 3D instead of like this, but it's 2D rendered. Like the only thing I like about it is you go up to a door and like you get up close to the door and you can see the outlines of the pixels. I know you can see that in this, but it's not so bad. But you're not because the camera's being moved for you over there. But yeah, apparently you can use a light gun with it, but I really don't think it needs it. The control, the control scheme's uh, pretty good with that one, but yeah, I guess it's better. Here we go. Wild snakey appears. I don't like a snake because it likes to trap you, it wraps around you and there's nothing you can do. I'd also love to know where the snake comes from because you find later on like there's someone hangs an umbrella. I'm an idiot for doing that, should I just That was easy. That was actually really fucking easy, actually. Am I poisoned? No, I'm not, but I still need some health. <sighs> hmm. Well, I'm gonna go back and uh, put some of this stuff away and heal myself just because when we drop down this part, there's a lot of pickups. You need to get. In fact, what am I doing? I can just go. I'll just go down there now, actually. I'm an idiot. I should have done that. I forgot I can go down there. Ignore the pickups, just kill some enemies and then open the door to get back up here. I believe, but I'll show you guys anyway. That was really easy, last time I fought the snake, it bit me. Like it ate me. It's too dark to see anything. Jill, have you found anything interesting? 
Yes, but I can't see very well. How about going down to check by yourself? I have a rope here. That makes sense. Oh, do you? Well, then I'll try to go down using the rope. Yeah, but she Wait. holds it up and you go down. You never thought about that, did you? Prick. I love her face, it's like, mm, innocent. You want to hurt me, Daddy. Oops! Hey, what's going on? Now I've done it. Sorry, Jill. Wait, I'll go and get another rope. Barry? Barry? How the fuck can you drop a rope? Oops, I dropped a rope. How? Really, how can you do that? Will you push it? Yes, I'll push the switch. This mansion was really well thought out, wasn't it? And the snake happens to smash the exact spot. Look at this small area. And the snake just happens to smash it. Yes, I've descended. It's so easy finding these zombies because I've got like a shotgun with loads of ammo. I don't like the music in this game though, I'd like to mention. It's not too bad, but the original was much scarier. And there's some shotgun shells just waiting. As if the game just knew. 94 shells. I'm doing pretty well. I love the way she runs, she looks awesome. I'm walking in the zombie's head. Listen to the scary music. No, I saw this will be easy. This will do nicely. I wonder if I need another one, probably don't, but screw it, I'll take it anyway. I'm just worried about inventory space because there's a key or something I need to pick up, that doesn't matter, I'm fully healed. <sighs> see that's what I mean, I, see that's the best tactic with the snake, I find just standing still, because I find, see if you if you move about it just wraps around you and you can't move and stuff. And that's how I got eaten last time, I couldn't move and it just chomped me up. Oh look, it's dead, it's dead. Is it fuck? Remember the trick with aiming? Never let you down. Just look at this lovely kitchen. Gas cooking stuff, the gas is not supplied. Oh. That was easy. I'm having, it's badly rested and does not seem to work. Someone took lots of good care on this place. <laughs> Lovely lift. I love how smooth the graphics go to the lift area. <laughs> Up a donny up a up a donny donny dang. Yeah, we're getting somewhere now. I think after this area, head off to the old garden. That's easy. Nice herbie waiting for me. Oh, nice zombie, I'm here to help you. Finding you lost? Can we help you find your way? I hope you find your way. I'm not. I'm not a bad guy. I'm just a zombie. <laughs> so we look at you. Do you want me to help you find your way? No, no thanks. I've got a shotgun. I don't need to be careful. I've got a gun. This game is so much easier with a shotgun. It's actually unreal. See this part in rebuff mode? You fight one of those. Uh, what? The, what the fuck they're called? Things? The flies? You fight one of them in this part. Here we go. Scrapbook. 
Raccoon, Raccoon Times, May 27th, 1998, Animal Attack, Women Mutilated, May 20th, around 10pm, a 20 year old young woman's body was found by a passerby on the left bank of Marble River on the Cider District of Raccoon City. Okay, bastards. Raccoon police assume it to be a grizzly or other animals doing because their teeth marks around her mutilated arms and left foot that show considerable power. Since she was wearing a hiking boot on her remaining foot, it's been determined she's attacked in the Arkley Mountains and fell into the river. They are hurrying to identify this woman. Raccoon, Le Raccoon Weekly, June 16th, 1998. Monsters in the Arkley Mountains. Some people claim they've seen monsters in the Arkley Mountains. These monsters are supposedly about the same size as large dogs and usually run in a pack as wolves do. This may sound like a group of ordinary wild dogs, but these monsters are surprisingly fierce, fierce and hard to hurt. They say these dogs won't bother you unless you wake them, so you smart readers should stay out the Arkley Mountains for the time being. But if you're out looking for adventure, check it out. Do you want to try? Raccoon Times, July 9th, 1998. Mystery in Arkley Mountains, Mountain Road blocked. Due to successive disasters in the Arkley Mountains, the city authorities have decided to block the road leading into the foothills. At the same time, Raccoon Police intend to begin the search for lost people to help a STARS team members. They expect great difficulty because of the vast size of the Arkley Mountains and the primeval forest that covers most of the area. Also, people are still reporting sightings of grotesque monsters in the mountains. I'd love to sit there with binoculars. Away from it safe. With binoculars. Binoculars trying to attack this. <laughs> Here we go. This, but that's pretty easy. Push this nice statue over here. Look, those graphics look different for the rest. I wonder why that is. Oh, up and down, up and down. Um, me buff mode, I believe, while the thingies come out, comes out of there. There's a switch, you push it. A bit late for that. What is this, MO disc? This is an MO disc, will you take it? Yeah, I'll take it, man. It sounds awesome. Imagine that. A birthday party or something, they're giving out lucky bags. Hey, I got a whistle! I, I, I got a pencil with a pencil topper on it. Hey, Jill, what did you get? Hey, I got an AMO disc! Christ, man. McDonald's Happy Meal. MO discs from Resident Evil and every single kid's meal. One, two, three. Ah, but only ten. Here we go. There we go. No need to waste time. I've got a lagger, so I'm okay. Ah, oh, man. Now we're talking. Ooh, the battery, that's what we need. Yep, we'll take the battery, man. Can't carry any more victims. Let's see, are those double acid, those double rounds? Wow, that 24. But you come in, so I'll certainly be back here before we leave. Piling old stuff in the event, we come back here and uh, collect old stock. Also, guys, remember to check out my fragrance videos as well. Some other stuff. Oh no! What is you? I just want to show you guys something on the map here, right? This really frustrates me. I need to march my ass all the way over here because that door's locked, right? See see the, the door that's locked? Literally that is like fucking that's the one that's locked with a keypad and you don't know the code. All you need to do is get the code somehow and that's that door unlocked, saving us a hassle of fuck if I'm to go around there all the other way. This is almost as bad as Richard with his fucking serum. I'm gonna get myself bitten. <sighs> I feel that angry, but it probably wasn't his fault. Snake probably trolled him like it done with me and wrapped around him so he couldn't move. Ah, 
for your game, is it Richard? Is it fuck for your game in this? Probably complete this game within about two hours, but just need to see. Music's crap in this split scene. The original music was like, dun, 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 dun. You're fucking shitting yourself. Open the nice door. Go up those nice stairs. What if there's a zombie around here? I'm sure there is. No, there's not. I unlocked it. And I'll need to be careful here because there's hunters, so. Need to be rather careful. That was a close call. I still get killed. Only get hit once, that wasn't too bad considering I couldn't see a fucking thing. Okay, what if there's one around here? No, there's not. And his body's disappeared. Wow, amazing. I love it when I kill the hunters. It makes me feel so good inside here and you scream. Oh, yes. I'm a sick fuck. And I love it. Nah, I'm good, guys. I'm not a sick fuck. I'm a sick creep. There's a difference. <laughs> I'm out there and thought I had something. I'm also interested to play Resident Evil Remake as well. Which I think will be fun. In fact, I believe, I'm not sure I showed you this, this cutscene here. With the dog. Start the game. <gasps> I love how the door closes in the dog's head, you know? Just out of here, you like, oh, fuck. It's also the only place you can see that camera angle you just seen there. Oh, so I don't need one here, but I'm going anyway because I want to kill the hunter. Because the hunter annoys me. So, yeah, she don't need to, but there's a hunter on here and they annoy me, so I'm going to kill it. And it will probably end up trying to kill me, so I'm not really bothered though. There we go. No more fucking around. I'm gonna be dead as a dodo if I keep this shit up. I don't really give a fuck. Okay, I'm gonna head to the. Probably go ahead to the next um, safe room area. I know. Alright, Dad. Probably go ahead to the next safe room area. Two seconds, what was that? In about five minutes. Shouldn't have thanks, Dad. So, yeah, I'm probably going to end this part and we get the next safe zone. I've clicked the MO disc, the battery, put back the mixed tabs. I shouldn't have Thank you. Okay, take care, man. I'm not looking forward to this area because I just know it's going to be a like, pain in the ass. I'm not even caring if I'm getting killed anymore. Poison. <gasps> Blue hemp. <laughs> I didn't see that one coming, did you? Also be collecting a lot more blue herbs as well. You sneak up on me. I'm the biggest prick and troll in the game, son. <clears throat> That's me cleared out in the other area at least. It's one path cleared. <sighs> Just go in here. Did we collect the Doom book? I think we did. Let's find out anyway. Uh, yeah, I can't remember if we did, so I'm just going to make sure by checking it. Don't want to fucking backtrack when I'm bloody all the way near 
Wait, is it? Yes, I did, but it was worth it just to check. Because this game's fucking tedious. Okay. Let's recount like my dad did. Do it like the Tony, do it like the Tang. You know the routine. Oh, yeah. Recount all the way. Recount, recount, recount. Everybody loves to recount. Everybody loves to recount. Don't, 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 don't. Okay, so. I'm going to equip the bazooka. Put this away, get the bazooka. I'm going to go back and uh, collect those lovely, lovely um, set of fucking shit bazooka rounds that I've seen in there. Can I quite like the look at them? Be interesting. Be fun. Blow some shit up for fun. Shits and gigs like, you know. Because I fucking can. Because oh, I'm that mental. Okay, and there we go. Equip the old basil car. Go back and collect those explosive rounds. Should be enough. 40. I'll have it bought 40 now. In fact, number 5, but what? 39, something stupid like that. Alright, so. I'm running all the way. In fact, you know what? I'm gonna go check out, right? Anyhow, in fact, I'll conclude this part here and then we'll go search out and get some stuff afterwards. Okay, this is part 7 the end. Look out for part 8, which will be coming in about 5 minutes. So yeah, thanks for watching, hope this video helped, look out for part 8. If you liked this, remember to subscribe. See you guys.